Hey everyone, what's going on? Going to go through workout number three for the 2017 Wet Hot Summer Throwdown. This is the final workout of the day that you guys will know what you're doing. And this workout is titled 10 Years Later after the new Wet Hot Summer, uh, Wet, Hot, uh, new Wet Hot American Summer series that is coming out on Netflix. I didn't get paid to say that, by the way. Um, so th this workout, real short, real sweet. This is in a tag team format style. So one partner is going to complete the entire workout, tag the other partner in, and then they're going to complete the entire workout. The ladies will be going first in both the RX and the scale division uh, before the men go um, for their rounds. So the women will go and then tag their male partner in, and then they're going to complete this workout, which is 15, 12, 9 rep scheme, calorie row, power snatch. So 15 calories in the rower, 15 power snatches, 12 calories in the rower, 12 power snatches, 9 calories in the rower. Hour, nine power snatches and there will be will be a time cap on this workout but that is still to be to de determined so we got coach bz on the rower right here we got ben we got john they're going to demonstrate some of these exercises so the rowing really really simple three two one go you guys can start by sitting on the rower brian's going to make sure his feet are all set up the Screen will just be on just row starting from zero and this must be cleared out to zero every single time you get back on the rower. So Brian's just gonna start doing some rowing. Doesn't have to do it too aggressively, you don't wanna get too tired. What we're looking at are these calories to get to 15. Real, real simple. Taking a look at his technique. Anything goes, obviously there's a more efficient way to do this. Using those legs. Again, this is gonna be a burner. That's good, Bri. So once Brian completes his 15 calories on the rower, he's gonna move over to the barbell. And we're just gonna demonstrate what the power snatch looks like. So the power snatch is gonna go from the floor, directly overhead to full lockout, to full extension at the hips by standing the weight all the way up. So Brian's gonna go from the ground, up, catch the full extension, stand all the way back up. He can drop the bar, he can touch and go. Essentially what we're looking for is that bar coming up from the ground, overhead to lockout, on every single rep. From the ground to lockout, overhead on every single repetition. So Brian can demonstrate a couple of no reps right here. So a no rep could look like not getting full lockout at the elbows and putting the bar down. So that would be a no rep. So do that one more time, Brian. Bar from the ground, not getting full lockout, that'd be a no rep. Another no rep would be, would be him being able to get full lockout at his elbows, but not standing all the way up. So getting partial hip extension. So bar from the ground, it's lockout but doesn't stand it all the way up and puts it back down. That's a no rep. So it needs to show full extension at the hips and at the elbows for that rep to be completed. So real one more time, one more good one by. So from the ground, right overhead. Dead. Awesome. Perfect. So again, rep scheme 15, 15, 12, 12, 9, 9. After Brian completes his 9, then he would run over to his partner. In this situation, it's Ben. He would tag Ben in. Ben would get on the rower and get after his 15, 12, 9 calorie row and power snatch. The prescribed weights for this workout for the RX men and women is 75 and 55, so pretty light. And the RX weight for the scale division is, or sorry, the prescribed weight for the scale division would be 55 and 35. And that is the workout number three of the 2017 Wet Hot Summer Throwdown. Thanks, guys.